In this tutorial, you will learn how to modify the timing of animated text. So for example, right now when I'm looking at this particular slide, I'm going to go ahead and click on Slideshow so that you can see this one slide and I'm going to say from the beginning. See when this particular slide comes in right now, nothing's happening, it's just a static slide. So I'm going to hit Escape and my goal here is to leave this area the same. However, for this part, for these two, I want the animation to be applied here. So by selecting this, I'm going to click and I'm going to select the Animations tab. My goal is to use an animated effect that is for Expand. When I look in here for Entrance, I don't see Expand, so I'm going to move down and I'm going to select More Entrance Effects. And my goal is to look under the area called Subtle and I'm going to click Expand. I'm going to select OK. And at this point, we can notice that animation has been applied to both lines. So I'm going to go and I'm going to click Preview just to see what happens and what this looks like. This doesn't look too bad. However, my goal is to add the text so that based upon the reading speed of the person looking at this, it is in sync with that. So in this particular case, what I'm going to do is I'm going to look at this top area. And what you'll notice is that it starts on click. So what I'm going to do is click the drop down and we get three different ways to start the text in an animated fashion. And I can do with previous, but with that, when I click on preview, everything comes in together. So what I'm going to do is click this one more time and I'm going to change it to after previous. And then I'm going to select preview again. And this is more like it because the text came in one behind the other but we can see that I can actually modify the way that this looks. So I'm going to click on the Animation pane. Again, I'm in the Animations tab. I'm looking in the Advanced Animation Group, and I'm going to click on Animation pane. By doing that, there's this area that I can click, so I can click to expand and see all the effects that I've added. And I can see that the first line starts, and as soon as it finishes, the second line picks up. So what I'm going to do is say for instance I want both lines to appear on the screen a little bit longer so instead of just one full second I'm going to increase this by one and a half seconds and I'm going to hit play and this is in line with the audience's reading speed I think that looks pretty good and then the last thing I'm going to do is click just this one line and my goal here is to delay the entrance of the second line by like a half second and with that, I want it to stay on the screen just a little bit longer, so I'm going to increase it by 0.25 seconds. And so this time, when I click on play, I can see how that looks. And I'm going to go in and I'm going to take a look at Slideshow tab. And here I'm going to select from the beginning. And now I can see that the text is coming in very nicely. So that's how you can modify the timing of your PowerPoint animation.